mean, Prestige and, and On play a lot of hands. I mean, they play 60% plus V pip. I think the difference is Prestige is probably more aggressive when On wants to see a lot of flops. Absolutely. We'll just take and see a lot of flops um, with any two cards. All right, Bruce, he's got a hand here. He's going to raise it to 40, pocket fours. Most people just call with pocket with a low pocket pair and hopefully set mine here. So I like the fact that he's being aggressive. If he hits a four, no one can put him on it. <laughs> and of course, Matt's got sixes. He's going to going to come along as well. So we got some nice hands. We got three pocket pairs, yeah. Here, yeah. And then we got Broadways. So this could be this could be fun. I just see a four, six, seven flop, please. Wow, Captain Dave just smashes this flop. <laughs> I like his check. I like his check, right? This will be I'm thinking this will be a check raise here. <laughs> Prestige is gonna go ahead and lead out for seventy. These two were in it earlier, as you remember. See if Matt smooths here. Yeah, I mean, if I was, I think that's a good call by Matt. Oh, we, we can. Oh, Captain Dave, you're right. No, I'm talking about Matt. I, I like, I like the call. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I love the call. What am I saying? Um, it's tough to put somebody on a jack, especially when Captain Dave limps there. You can't put him on a jack. And impossible. You could put him on a impossible, but unlikely he could have been six or seven. And so Matt's got the boat. He should, his hand, although he's got a boat, it's pretty vulnerable right now. I would expect a raise here. Uh, just because if somebody does have a jack, they could pair their other card. And, but he's going to like to, oh, he's a big bet too. He's going to like to call this. Course. And with two players in already, Prestige is just going to have to. Yeah. It was just one player. I see. I can see a call there. So this card might help Captain Dave a little bit because a flush did come in the front door flush. <laughs> but he only has an SPR less than one, so stock uh, stack to pot ratio. So, given that information, this looks like it's going to be. I expect Captain Dave to be all in here. Even if Captain Dave checks, Matt's going to push. With that much money in the pot, yeah, I mean, he literally could be a twenty-five hundred dollar pot. <laughs> Maybe you've like got top maybe. trips. So. <laughs> Captain Dave avoids losing the rest of his stack. I'm saying your name. He was talking about who's kind of been playing regular on this game. <laughs> Captain Dave, boats are not his friend tonight. Definitely. <laughs> Matt, I know it's early on. Matt has not played a lot of hands. He's not gotten out of line. So this is very telling here. It's one of the smaller raises you'll see. You don't only see $20 raises anymore in, in 2 5. It's usually like 30. To, even if there was no, uh, yeah, if there was no, uh, no straddle. It just invites everybody in. So you are four way to the flop again with some marginal holdings here. I saw a five right in the window. Yep. <laughs> so this may look like a good flop for Corey, but it's not, right? Because he's uh, he's the bottom end of the straight draw, the gut shot actually, and he's bottom pair. Prestige does have well, he's got he's got a two-way draw here, so he's got he can hit a ten for a straight or a six for a straight. So he's got to like his hand here. That's a good lay down by. By Corey, a lot of people call that. I agree. A lot of people call that one pair with the gut shot. Um, but I like I like that fold. I was somewhat expecting you to call it. Yeah. yeah. Still our last stream. Now this club is interesting. I don't I don't know if Matt's played a lot here in Texas, 
Prestige could really rep this with the bluff, right? And he has outs on the river if he wants to raise this. He read his mind. Oh, there you go. So, yeah. So, he's going to rep this club, and then he's going to hit his straight. <laughs> Based on the way things have been going. Of course, Matt, our uh, Matt's profit got his, leader so far. He's got bottom set here, and the board is super straighty, and now the flush came in. Um, I can see a fold here. There's no, no shame in that, but he's going to like to make the call there. Well, that's not going <laughs> to. Matt's now got a boat. So now Matt beats all the flushes. Now, Matt's not, not tanking here, <laughs> no. thinking about folding. He is <laughs> thinking about raising yeah. or or just calling it. Because he, he is vulnerable, right? King 8, King 7, all those goofy kind of hands. Yeah. yeah, this is never, I don't think this is ever going to be a raise. Because what do you get called with? Just a single king or a flush? Yeah, that's not. He does. Prestige, you did put a lot of pressure on him. That's a, that's a full size bet there. Full pot size. All in. He jammed. Wow. Aggressive play by Matt. Raise <laughs> 25. <laughs> So I don't, yeah, I don't think we saw a straddle. I think this is just a 2-5 right now. Captain Dave is going to raise this up. No, he just calls with Dave's queen. Yeah, I don't, I'm not a big fan of that. You're just inviting. It's just going to go multi-way. I would much rather see Captain Dave make this raise here. He's seen what these players have already played with a little bit. So now it would go five ways to a flop. Oh my goodness. I almost said I need a minute Matt here to hit a four and on has a four. I need to figure out the hands here. Wow. So we have we have two sets, a gut shot with one pair, and the ace queen is behind everybody except do. Faker's gonna lead out. I like that. The board should favor all the callers here. On does have a backdoor straight flush, which I've seen him hit a couple of streams ago <laughs> that I was commenting on. He hit a straight flush. Wow. And so he's, he, I think it was the exact same hand, except there were diamonds. Uh, six four diamonds. And we are going four ways to the flop. And the pot's already at 427. And that brings Captain Dave. Oh, with that's the not a good card for Captain yeah. Dave. He thinks it is. With two yeah. sets already on there. This is a beast. I would expect, yeah, Faker to bleed out here for something pretty big, too, given the fact that he goes all in. Captain Dave is going to go ahead and uh, ship it, although it's really just the same. It's just calling the Faker's bet here. No way Matt goes away here either. Matt's thinking they must have flush draws or, or some sort of goofy combo draw here. I think with this many players in the hand, there's going to be three when it gets to on. I think on just goes and lays this down. He would have to, right? On definitely has to lay it down. I'm wondering what Matt's going to do here. I think he might. He might just ship it. I think I think so too. Faker has 1.2 behind, so this is SPR yeah. of one. So it doesn't it just falls? Oh. Big pot of Bruin, 1,600. Faker has less than pot size. Matt has a lot of chips because he's, he's won a few hands here. So the flush gets there. Doesn't make anybody happy because if they were just calling, you typically are doing that with some sort of draw. Faker and Matt hated that card. The queen would have been nasty. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. 
Baker is going through all the possibilities of what could Matt be calling with. I don't think he's really worried about Captain Dave, but he's really worried about Matt. Who is he calling on on a flush draw there? And did he hit? So I think he just checks this. And Matt will be glad <laughs> to, to, to go ahead and, and check as well. Matt's been shown to be aggressive in position though. Oh. He, oh, he goes all in. I think he's going to. Matt's going to. You think he'll call? I do because. Leaning, yes. Yeah. I mean, it's really. 1,200 is a lot, but it's really not a lot as compared to the pot. Matt's got a lot of profit he's working with already. And if you're Matt, you would expect Faker, since he's a pre flop aggressor, to be betting all streets here, right? Yeah. So. And he was shown to try to bluff optimize a couple hands ago. And I think if you're Matt, you can work your way through this, right? So what would he jam here, multi-way, knowing that he's going to see his hand anyway? You know, two pair. The flush got there. The straight got there. Even, so the straight flush got there. <laughs> straight. Could 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 Faker put have kings here? I'm actually a bit impressed that he's mulling it over for this long. A lot of people would just snap call with their set. I'm surprised they weren't there wasn't more money in the pot on the flop. <laughs> so there it goes. Yeah. Set set. Nice 4K pot. Faker, wow, he went for value on uh, the, on that on that run out there on that on that river. Nice, nice play. 